Hey everybody, Vid Mystery, the Transformers collector here with five BotCon Transformer surprise eggs. Now you might be asking yourself, why are the BotCon toys in these giant eggs? Well, we thought it'd be a fun way to reveal this year's offerings. Your toys, as always, will come in a souvenir convention box with each one of the toys placed inside a foam insert with their tech specs and their weapons and all their accessories. So you will get your toys, as always, in the usual way, in a very awesome box. But for the reveal, we're going to reveal these one at a time. And we'll get to some of the more story stuff as we do more of the reveals. And I guess I should mention that, because you're probably all sitting there thinking, oh, am I getting to see all five toys right now? I'm afraid not. We're going to do one toy at a time. So this will be our first reveal. And then after we do this one, well, we'll pick another egg. So let's go ahead and start with the first one here. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right. So what do we got here? Oh, let's crack her open. Oh. Let's see, there's a little, a little piece of paper in there, I think. Oh, I see it. We've got BotCon 2015. The Thief, Pack Rat. So there he is. This is a repaint of the Transformers Generations Rat Trap figure. Longtime BotCon fans will know that this was a figure first, of, or a character, and a deco first released back in BotCon 97. And here we've got him now making his appearance. He's got the angry face. Making his appearance once again at BotCon 2015. So, now that we know who the figure is, let's find out a little bit about him. From his tech spec, Packrat is the consummate collector. Nothing he desires escapes his watchful eye. And check out the deck on those eyes. If Packrat sets his energon pump on something, he will stop at nothing to acquire it. Packrat's teammates make an extra effort to lock up their quarters when he's around, often to no avail. Packrat likes to point out that his hoarding has helped the Maximals from time to time when he was able to produce a needed part or tool for a given situation. However, in some cases, the needed item was procured from Maximal property for his collection in the first place. Packrat is loyal to the Maximal cause, but is equally loyal to his hoard. This can cause an internal conflict when he must choose to save a comrade or a piece from his collection. Next question. How does Packrat here fit into the theme of Cybertron's Most Wanted? Well, Packrat currently resides in a universe that is home to a group of Transformers known as the TransTech. TransTech kind of live in a multiversal hub. There are Transformers from all different continuities that end up in this universe and in this city called Axiom Nexus. Autobots, Decepticons, Maximals, Predacons, might be even a Destructon uh, roaming around, uh, Minicons. Well, one of the rules, pretty much the only rule is, is you just have to get along. And for the most part, 98% of the population in Axiom Nexus gets along. But of course, as with anything, you got Pack right here and a few of his friends that don't really want to follow the rules. And that's how they became Cybertron's most wanted. Let's see how Pack Rat looks in robot mode. Got a very awesome white, the blue, very happy with that. Now, we did ask for a small change to the bronze you can see here on his hands and on the uh, on his rat feet. Note that, as always, final product and colors may vary. So while this is pretty close to final, we did ask for something that was a little closer to the original pack rat. But as you can see, there's a lot of similarities. Put his gun down a little bit so you can kind of see that. So I think fans and collectors who uh, who dig the original Pack Rat are gonna really dig this BotCon 2015 version of Pack Rat. So you need to stay tuned as we will be revealing another figure here in just a little over a week. Maybe just a little under a week. We'll see might be exactly a week from today. Well, that's gonna do it for this reveal, but make sure you stay tuned to botcon.com for all the latest news, guest updates, additional toy reveals. We've got a brochure we're working on. We've got the registration coming before you know it. 
So it's going to be a busy next month. So again, stay tuned. We hope uh, you enjoy this and it's going to be a, a, a big, big, fun, fun, huge, huge month. That was so ridiculous to say. See you soon. Thanks. Bye.